The Washington State Cougars holding their final scrimmage today for the Crimson and Gray game next weekend. Quarterback Jeff Tool threw for four touchdown passes, and the WSU defense forced four turnovers this afternoon. Tool went 22 of 47 for 200 yards and four scores and two interceptions. The defense won the day, forcing four turnovers blocking a field goal and making a fourth down stop. The transition has been easy from the 4-3 to the 3-4 defense. Nothing has really been too challenging. It's actually easier, you know, it's actually easier uh, to switch over from the 4-3 because uh, I feel like last year when we were in the 4-3, we are you know, kind of playing like close to the line of scrimmage, not like a real safety. But, you know, now it's like we have linebacker help on the receiver if there's a slot out there. And, you know, we can actually play a real safety and, you know, uh, help the corner with the receivers. So I like it. Meanwhile, in Moscow, the Idaho Vandals holding their final scrimmage for the silver and gold game this coming Friday. Quarterback Taylor Davis went 13 of 23 for 132 yards and one score. While Dominique Blackman took the bulk of the snaps, he was 11 of 16 for 83 yards. The defense, they had an interception return for a touchdown. Head coach Rob Akey excited to see big plays, the intensity, and most of all, improvement. I thought we competed well. I thought it was a pretty physical goal today, and I thought that was a good thing. I think both sides did some real good things, and I was happy about that. I thought it was a good scrimmage. I thought it was uh, we gained some good ground, and it was good to see some life uh, start taking place for the offense. And if we can just gain a little more maturity as a football team, um, I think that will help us grow a little bit also. So it's kind of good we got through that situation a little bit today. The Spokane Shock are searching for their very first home win of the season tonight as they welcome the Milwaukee Mustangs to the arena. Spokane off to a 1-3 and three start. They'll try to snap a two-game losing streak. However, the Mustangs are a very well-coached team, and this one will come down to who takes care of the ball the best. They mix up some zone with man. They play actually more man than zone, and uh, I think we can uh, exploit that if, uh, if you know we get up and, uh, and run our deep routes well. They're a consistent team. They're well coached. Um, they don't they don't do anything special, but they, they do the basics well. That's that's one of the reasons they're two and one. Um, they get a lot of credit of turnovers on defense, and they don't turn the ball over on offense. So this game is about turnovers, and they're in the positives on that portion of the season. So uh, they're doing extremely well right now, and, and it's, we're going to have a, a fight for us on Saturday night. An overtime thriller at the Spokane Arena last night as the Spokane Chiefs got even with the Tri-City Americans. The game was tied at two at end regulation when Spokane center Dominique Uhair scored six minutes and 28 seconds into overtime to lead Spokane past the ends three to two in game four. There's no time to celebrate though with a tight turnaround as game five is set for tonight. You know, uh, it's tough games and it's tough playoff and uh, we had a tough schedule early in the, se early in the season. So uh, I think uh, we're going to be prepared. We're going to put our best and then uh, we're coming to try for a win. It's a hard building to play in, but we're, uh, we're used to it now and we know what to expect. I mean, uh, the first 10 minutes are going to be key and uh, we have to uh, t treat our bodies right tonight and uh, the day tomorrow and uh, make sure we're ready to play in full of energy. So uh, take the momentum and uh, head into their rink uh, this time and hopefully come out successful. College baseball, the Gonzaga Bulldogs looking for their fourth straight win today as Mark Maktoff Zags hosting Santa Clara. Marco Gonzalez back on the hill after having surgery for a torn meniscus. He gets into a jam early with a runner in scoring position. He strikes out Andrew Beon Cardi. Later in the second of this one, two on, two out. Zach Looney, base knock, right side, Pat Stover. He'll come home to score, and Santa Clara draws first blood. Gonzalez, five innings, six hits, three runs, two of those earned. Zags down two zip in the third. Two on for Royce Bollinger. Well, he ropes with three run jack to left center. Gonzaga takes the lead. They never look back. They go on to win. 8-3 final score. It's mom's weekend at Washington State. No better mom to throw out the first pitch than former Cougar great Steve Gleason's mom. That's Gail Gleason. Packed house says the Cougs hosting the Utah Utes today. First inning, Cougs in trouble. Two batters on for Joe Pitorisi. Gets him out, back-to-back -back strikes out there. He went four innings, allowed three hits, one earned run, and five strikeouts. Top of the second, Utah's Travis still batting zero on the year. Hits his first collegiate hit. It's a memorable one. Deep to right field. The wind carries it over the wall. Utes up one nothing. Cougs defense steps up here. Mar Parker Morin rips one for what looks like a base hit, but Taylor R with the diving glove and gets flips it for the out. Just in time. The Cougs drop this one in 10 innings, 4-3 final score. The Seattle Mariners right in action right now, scoreless in the first inning. We'll have highlights coming right at 11. To the pitch, the Seattle Sounders hosting the Colorado Rapids, 33rd minute. Omar Cummings with the right-footed shot in this one from the left side of the box, but it's saved. The flag goes up as Brian Mullen is caught offside. The goal does not count. Disappointed there. 63rd minute, still no score. Zach Scott, the header from the left 
left side to the bottom right corner. He scores his first MLS goal. Sounders take the lead 1 0. That's how they win it. 1 to nada. All right, that's sports. Mondays and Weather at after the break.